Ontario Power Generation, safely managing radioactive waste today and in the long term. Ontario Power Generation, or OPG, is an Ontario-based electricity generating company. Our focus is on the production and sale of electricity from our generation assets, while operating in a safe, open and environmentally responsible manner. This includes the safe management of radioactive waste from our nuclear generating stations. Under the regulatory requirements of the Canadian Nuclear Safety Commission, OPG is responsible for the interim storage, transportation and long-term management of this radioactive waste. Managing the waste today. In a nuclear plant, there are three types of nuclear waste, low, intermediate and high-level waste. Low-level waste includes minimally radioactive materials such as mop heads, cloths and paper towels that are used in the nuclear stations during routine operation and maintenance. Intermediate-level waste consists of used reactor components as well as resins and filters used to keep reactor water systems clean. High-level waste is used fuel. OPG operates three waste management facilities in Ontario. The Pickering and Darlington Waste Management Facilities provide dry fuel storage for their respective sites. The Western Waste Management Facility provides central storage for low and intermediate level waste received from the Pickering, Darlington and Bruce generating stations, as well as dry fuel storage for the Bruce site. The first step in the management of the low and intermediate level waste is its transport to the Western Waste Management Facility at the Bruce site. OPG uses several different types of packages to safely transport radioactive materials. Low-level waste is packed in plastic bags and placed in metal shipping containers. Intermediate-level waste is loaded into more robust, specially reinforced and shielded transportation packages. All of the shipping packages are built to the stringent requirements specified by the Canadian Nuclear Safety Commission. OPG's Radioactive Materials Transportation Program is also regulated by Transport Canada. Once received at the Western Waste Management Facility, the low-level waste is processed to reduce its volume by either compaction or incineration. The incinerator, with state-of-the-art emission controls, plays a key role in minimizing the volume of stored waste. It is capable of achieving a volume reduction of 70 to 1. Following processing, the low-level waste is placed in warehouses called low-level storage buildings. The intermediate-level waste, because of its radiological and physical properties, is not processed for volume reduction. Intermediate-level waste is stored in steel-lined concrete containers that have been set into the ground. After being removed from the reactors by fueling machines, the used fuel bundles are first stored in the nuclear station's water-filled pools. After 10 years in water storage, the used fuel bundles have cooled sufficiently to be removed from the spent fuel bays. They are placed in dry storage containers and transferred to our waste management facilities at the nuclear sites. Each dry storage container is made of reinforced concrete 20 inches thick and is lined inside and outside with half-inch steel plate. This thickness of concrete and steel provides a protective barrier against radiation. At the waste management facility, the container is welded and readied for storage. Rigorous testing is done to ensure it is absolutely leak tight and safeguard seals are applied by an inspector from the International Atomic Energy Agency. Managing the waste in the long term. Along with a proven track record of safely managing nuclear waste for the past 40 years, OPG has also been making significant progress in preparing for the future management of the waste. OPG is a key player in nuclear waste research and development. We support investigative studies at several Canadian universities and exchange knowledge, experience and research with the international community. 
It is also our responsibility to have money in place to cover the long-term management of our waste and the eventual decommissioning of our nuclear power plants. To meet these liabilities and to ensure that today's consumers, not future generations, are bearing the cost, OPG has established segregated funds solely for this purpose. We contribute approximately $450 million annually into these funds, which now stand in excess of $7 billion. OPG is also poised to take the next step in the long-term management of low and intermediate radioactive waste with the development of the Deep Geologic Repository, or DGR as it is often called. A preliminary design of the repository shows that the DGR will look similar to a mine and will be located 660 meters or 2,150 feet below the Bruce site in limestone rock. The DGR will consist of vaults excavated out of the rock and arranged in rows on either side of a central access tunnel. Based on an independent assessment study, OPG believes the proposed location for the DGR will provide a safe environment in which to safely isolate low and intermediate level waste for thousands and thousands of years without any significant impact on employees, the public or the environment. A thorough environmental assessment of the project has begun. It includes a five-year site characterization program guided by international experts to confirm the suitability of the proposed site. Pending regulatory approval, construction of the DGR could begin around 2012, with operations commencing about 2017. In terms of the long-term management of the used nuclear fuel, it is the Nuclear Waste Management Organization, of which OPG is a member, that is the leader in this area. The NWMO has recommended to the federal government that Canada follow an adaptive phased management approach for the long-term management of used fuel. This flexible approach includes continued reactor site storage with an optional step of central storage of the used fuel followed by centralized containment and isolation in a deep repository in a willing host community. For over 40 years, OPG has provided safe interim storage for Ontario's nuclear station's radioactive waste and is making significant progress in preparing for the safe, long-term management of the waste. If you would like more information on our nuclear waste management program or have any questions, please feel free to talk to our staff or visit the OPG website, www.opg.com.